Okay, so there's a real reason why Casio state categorically in their manual not to wear uh, their G-Shocks or their resin uh, watches, case watches, in the shower, especially with soap and detergents. And that's because the resins that these are, when they talk about resins, what these watches are made of, are polyurethane resins, or P-U-R in short. And you can see that sometimes will be written, here's on the back of the watch, it'll be difficult to see it with this camera here, but I'll put a high resolution picture in there, P-U-R there, this is a polyurethane resin band, and the polyurethanes can be made in different stiffnesses, different hardnesses, they're abrasion resistant, uh, depends on what kind of polyurethane resin it is, will depend on what kind of chemical resistance it has. Now, this is the GWG-1000. So on the GWG-2000, this part at the top of the watch here and here is actually made out of a carbon fiber reinforced uh, resin, a slightly different kind of resin called a peak resin, polyether ether ketone, and, and that's a different kind of resin on there, but these ones are polyurethane um, type resins. What grade of polyurethane resins, uh, I don't know, and I doubt that Casio will actually reveal that uh, to the public anyway. But it is not resistant to strong alkalis or alkali continued uh, subjection to alkali based chemicals. And let's face it, soap and detergents are very alkaline. So if you continue to wash uh, get your G-Shock covered, resin case covered in alkali solutions all the time you are going to probably weaken it and or destroy it um, at best or worst rather. So that's why it's really important not to wear them in the shower. It has nothing to do with heating the things up with hot water in the shower. It's to do with the soaps and detergents. Alright, thanks for watching. Bush Camp and Tools here.